I've already got some great advice, but I reckon my next expert is going to have a thing or two to say on this topic. I've come here to the Rooks Heath High School to meet Neil Shah from the Stress Management Society, who's running an insect day here. I'm hoping to get some tips on how to remain calm and collected during term time. Anything you can offer me that's going to help me maintain that healthy lifestyle, that balance between work and play, please, it would be appreciated. There we go. So that's Aaron's plea. Now, do you think a bit of stress management is going to help him out? Definitely. He's exhausted because he's, keep, he's operating in a state of stress, which is a, a, a very exhausting state to be in. We're not designed to be stressed for long periods of time. Stress is only supposed to be there to serve us for a short bursts of energy to either fight or run away from whatever it is that's stressing us out. So I think that the learning to manage his stress and learning um, what's going on inside him when he's stressed will be a very useful place for him to start. And then obviously look at techniques that he can incorporate into his life to, to, to relax him. So you've got a busy teacher, it's got five minutes between lessons, how can they effectively de-stress in those five minutes? Even a, a quick five minute walk around the playground can start to help to, to alleviate that feeling of stress. By taking some deep breaths and by regulating our breathing, we can then start to, 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 to bring ourselves into more of a state of balance. I can show you a technique, if you just like to stand up. So if you just literally extend your arms out and we're just gonna pump our breath. So as we pull our, our, our elbows into our chest, we're just gonna, we're gonna breathe out through our, no, uh, through our mouth, okay? And we breathe in as we extend our arms outwards. And repeat. And again. You're gonna start by speeding up a bit. Superman speed. <laughs> it's too short, too short. <laughs> it's really hard work, but good, actually. I just... How do you feel? Well quite energised actually I mean I, you know I guess standing up and, and moving around and also concentrating on your breathing is, is a real way of energising if you're a teacher and you've been sitting down a lot and, and shallow breathing quite a lot just just doing that for a few minutes would really really energise you great to sit down after all that now um, and if we're thinking more long term for, for teachers actually trying to get through the whole of a term um, what sort of long term tips on de-stressing can you give us well, one of the key things that I would suggest is incorporating relaxation and stress management into your daily routine. Look at stress and how it's affecting you as an individual and then what you can incorporate into your life on a daily basis to ensure that you're managing your stress and, and ensuring that you're taking time out of your day to relax. And what sort of resources are available to teachers about de-stressing? The main one is the Stress Management Society's website and it's a site that we put together um, to actually provide a lot of free resources for individuals. There's lots of articles, um, there's lots of resources, lots of information, tips and techniques on how to manage stress. Thanks very much for your tips, it's actually been very relaxing talking to you. No problem.